you know, we gave him a little bit of time off. We felt like we gave him a chance to get healthy. And then Thursday and Friday, we came back and, and got ahead of Villanova a little bit and had a couple team periods where we kind of introduced some of their defensive and offensive schemes and had a very productive week. So well, Everybody uh, that was banged up could get uh, the rest they needed. Uh, we were mentally focusing, just ready for uh, Villanova. So I thought it was a pretty good bye week. In the CAA, crazy stuff happens every weekend. So, I mean... Right now, it's just the next up. That's our motto, next up mentality. Doesn't matter, get better, so. They're, they're a very good you know, football team on both sides of the ball. You know, it starts for them. Their quarterback is playing as well as anybody in the conference and in the country. He's explosive. He can make plays with his feet. He's accurate from the pocket and also can run around. Oh, we got to get him off his spot. I mean, they haven't let up many sacks this year. The most they've let up is when they play JMU. I think they got about six or something like that. But even, even then, if he's off his spot, he's pretty good throwing the ball on the run. So, I mean, we just got to get to him. We got to finish. Max and the QBs have to do a great job of getting the ball out of their hand quick and on time and continue to make some contested plays on the perimeter. I think for us, you know, leaning on the, the run game like we have through the, the first part of the season is going to have to be something we have to do as well. Just looking at their defense, they're pretty uh, – they're physical, they're big. They made a lot of plays. November is always the important month of like the season, you know, uh, mistakes are critical, like you can't afford any kind of like lapse during games. So I'd say just handle it day by day, uh, week by week. So it's always just kind of that philosophy I've had over the years to just keep moving forward.